Hi guys, how's it going? My name is Killer Queen 55 and today I'm going to bring you a couple of relaxing hard pills to swallow. A couple of hard truths that maybe you don't want to hear, maybe are rough to hear. But I think everyone needs to hear at some point in their life. They're just kind of important life lessons that the sooner you learn in life, the easier and the better your life can be. I would like to put on a little disclaimer that if you are possibly going through a rough patch right now, this may or may not be the best video for you to watch. But if you're looking for a little bit of motivation, a good kick in the bum to get you going in the right direction, then I think you've come to the right place. So let's get going with um, some hard pills and some tough truths to swallow. The first tough truth is that most people most people, most people are just in it for themselves. Most people have a motive behind every action they do. Not everyone, but the majority of people are looking out for number one. And that number one isn't you, that number one's them. And so you should always be wary of trusting most people. Deep down, you might know that this is true for you as well. That just maybe you have experienced doing something because you want to come off as nice. Now, are you really doing it to be kind? Or are you doing it so that you seem like you're kind? Is it coming deep down from the bottom of your heart? Or is it coming from somewhere else? This is a tough pill to swallow, but if you can accept that everyone can only see the world from their own perspective, it can make your own perspective a bit different, because you can then realize that you control your perspective, just like everyone else is in control of their perspective. Our next big truth, our next tough pill to swallow is that your biggest, 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 biggest regret in life is that you won't do it. And this could be anything, anything at all. You could spend years regretting not applying to the school you wanted to. You could spend years regretting not trying out for that position you wanted. You could spend years regretting not asking out that girl. You could spend years regretting not asking out that guy. You could spend years regretting that you pretended to be somebody you're not. This is a hard truth for most people is that you think you want to please people or you have to please people. But if you aren't doing what you love, and if you never, ever, 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 at least try, then you might spend the rest of your life regretting it. It's a tough thing to hear, but it is 100% true. So even if you think you might fail, even if you think they might reject you, even if you think that you're not going to get it, even if you think you don't good enough, you'll never actually know if any of that is true if you're not going to get the job, if you're not going to get the position, if you're not going to do it right, if you are going to fail. You will never know that unless you try. And if you don't try, you will regret it. The next hard truth that nobody likes to hear, so we're gonna try to soften this one up a little bit. Our next hard truth is that the one, your Prince Charming, your perfect girl, 
they do not exist. There is no perfect one. There is no soulmate for you that will complete you. You, you have to learn how to become a complete person. You have to make yourself happy. You are the one who's responsible for your own happiness. You are the one who has to complete yourself. No one can do this for you. Only you are capable of doing this. There is no one. You are the one. And you need to understand that. You cannot rely on anyone else for your happiness. You cannot rely on anyone else to make you happy. You cannot get mad at anyone else or blame anyone else for your unhappiness. You have to take full responsibility for your own life. You are the master of your own universe. No one is going to come around and complete you and make your life whole and make you happy and satisfy you 100%. You have to be the one. Only you can do that. It's entirely within your own power. It's a hard truth because many people hope that one day they'll find someone to rescue them. No one's coming to rescue you. No one's coming to save you. You are the only person who can help yourself because our next hard truth actually is perfect for this. It goes right off of this point that you have to make yourself happy and that nobody else in this world is capable of it but you. And you also cannot find the perfect partner and you cannot create the perfect partner because our next hard truth is that you, you cannot control other people. You are only in control of yourself. You are only in control of your own actions. You are only in control of what you do. Nobody, nobody, nobody else. You are the master of your own reality. You cannot control other people. You cannot control other people. You are not capable of controlling anyone other than yourself. No one can control anyone but themselves. The only person you can control is you. You are the only one. It is not up to anyone else. Now, Our truth is that someone will always, 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 always have more than you. Someone is always going to be better than you. You will never truly be the best. Now, I know you might be thinking, oh, but what if I win a gold medal? Well, wait a couple years. Some child will come along and they'll be so much better than you. Now, this is a very, 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 very important lesson. Because if you understand that someone will always be better, then you are capable of understanding that you are also capable of being better that if you try harder you can grow more if you keep pushing you can get there and that you can always be better than someone else but 
someone might come along and be better than you. So you should use that to remember to not give up and to keep trying harder and harder and harder and harder until you succeed and always have one eye over your shoulder. Just know that there's always someone running up behind you looking to take that number one spot. Someone will always be better than you. So you should always try to be your very best. Our next hard truth is that you are going to fail. You are going to fail again and again and again and again. You are going to fail over and over and over and over. You are going to fail so many times as you can't count. But the important thing is that you learn from your failures and you don't let them beat you up. Use every time you fall as a way to motivate you do better because you are capable of things but you have to accept that failure is part of life you have to acknowledge that everyone fails including you and you aren't any different from anyone else you are just like everyone else if you really want to set yourself truly be different, then try harder. Their next hard truth is that point exactly. It's that not everyone gives a hundred percent. Most people only give about 40, sometimes 30 percent effort in everything they do. Most people are extremely lazy. You're probably I know I can be pretty lazy sometimes, but if you can acknowledge that, then maybe you can try to be different. But most people aren't. Most people don't try. Most people don't care. Most people would rather just sit at home and eat snacks and watch Netflix. I know I sure do want to do that just binge watch anime and get chubby but you have to accept that you don't always give a hundred percent it's almost actually impossible to do that it'll burn you out if you do if you give a hundred percent every day of your life you're likely going to become exhausted and burn out and then you'll only be capable of giving 30%. You won't have a choice. So I'd say give 80%. Try your best. But save a little bit of that energy for you. Our next hard truth. And this is a truth that is sure a hard one. But it's important to accept because it'll help you move on from anything in life and that is that some people <sighs> some people some people some people in life are going to love you and some people are not and it's usually nothing that you've done it's just you you just have to accept that some people simply do not like you. And it doesn't mean you need to go and change yourself and be somebody different. You just need to understand that everyone has different views. Everyone has different likes. Everyone has different desires. Everyone has different opinions. Everyone is different. And at the same time, we're all exactly the same. But so you need to accept.
find you annoying, but that's okay, because you will find the people out there that'll like you. And also, you don't want to spend time with the people that don't like you. They're not worth your time. So the sooner you accept that not everyone's going to love you, and you move on from them, the better. No one has to love you. Not everyone has to like you. Everyone is allowed to have their own opinions. And it goes back to our other hard truth that you can't control what other people like. The sooner you accept those two truths, the better. You can't control others. Not everyone's going to love you. Not everyone's going to like you. And you can't change their mind about that. You just have to. You have to. Have to. Have to. You just have to accept it. Because our next hard truth is that you are the captain of your own ship. You control your life. It isn't your boyfriend's fault. It isn't your girlfriend's fault. It isn't your boss's fault. It isn't the government's fault. It isn't your teacher's fault. It isn't your parents' fault. You control your life. You are in charge of your existence. Now, for anyone who is younger, still living with their parents, still in high school, this might sound like a hard truth to swallow as it was for me when I was in high school. did realize that I was capable of choosing so much more than I thought I was back then. You're not stuck. You're not trapped. You're making excuses. You are in control of your own life. If you don't like your job, then find a new one. If you're not happy with your partner, then find a new one. And if you don't like where you live, find a different solution. There is always an answer. You just need to try harder. There's always a way out. You just have to go and find it. There is an answer. There is a solution. Stop making excuses. Stop making excuses. Go out there and just do it. Stop blaming other people for it. You are the captain of your own ship. You are the master of your own reality. Now, here is a Fun, 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 hard truth. You think about yourself more than anybody else does. This is because you only see things from your own perspective. You think about yourself all the time. Try it for a day. Try and not to think about yourself. It's impossible. It's really hard. But once you start noticing it, you will really, 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 really notice how much you think about yourself. And then you need to realize that nobody, 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 nobody thinks about you as much as you think about you. No one's ever going to love you as much as you are capable of loving yourself. And so you really need to learn how to love yourself. If you're going to think about yourself all day, why would you not love yourself? That just doesn't make any sense. Our next hard truth. That is so, so, so hard for this generation. And so difficult to understand when we live in a world where things happen so quickly. 
quickly and so easily. <sighs> Is that your life? Is a one day, one, one day, one day at a time endeavor? This means that you cannot start a project and expect it to be done right away. Whatever goals you have, whatever dreams you have, give yourself time for them. Find, think of a big goal that you have. Do you want to graduate from school? Do you want to buy a house? Do you want to start a business? Do you want to learn a new skill? Whatever this goal is, you have to, have to, have to, have to, have to, you have to understand that it's not going to happen overnight. That it is going to take time and a lot of time to complete. Give yourself lots of time. Set yourself a 10 year goal and then break it up into little chunks. Break it up into first every year what you want to have completed by then. And then break it up into months. And then break it up into days. And give yourself lots of time to complete your goals. They're not going to happen right away. Every day isn't going to be a good day. You're not going to be productive every day. You're not going to be happy every day. But that's life and you need to accept that about life. You're going to have bad days. You're going to have good days. What's important is that you don't lie to yourself about it and that you're honest with these times and that you give yourself lots of time give yourself time and be patient nothing happens overnight nothing can be created quickly and if it is created quickly it might be done very poorly so give yourself time be patient with yourself nothing happens overnight. There is no one day endeavor. Your life is a day by day, by day, by day, by day journey that you're experiencing right now. And the next hard truth is one that nobody likes to hear, but a lot of people could use it. And that sometimes the problem is you. Sometimes it's not them. Sometimes it's you. It's not them. It's you. You're the problem. You're the one who messed up. You are the problem. You're the one who messed up. deny it. Don't try to pretend like you didn't do anything wrong. Admit that you're the one who messed up. Apologize and go from there. Because if you can't admit that you've made a mistake, how can you grow from it? I'll give you an example for myself. I recently said something to someone that was petty. And I said it knowing very well that it would hurt their feelings because they had previously hurt my feelings. But then I met with them again and I apologized and admitted that I was being petty. And it wasn't fun. Nobody likes admitting that they're wrong or that they did something bad. But if you don't do that, you can't move on from there. 
Sometimes you have to admit that you are the one who's wrong. That you're the problem. That you're the issue. And you need to do something about that. You can't just continue on with your life pretending that you're perfect. Because you are not perfect. Nobody is perfect. No one in this world is perfect. And if you think someone is perfect, they're probably lying. So you need to understand that you, the problem, might very well be you. That you're the issue. It's nobody else's fault. That it is your fault. You need to take that and use it to grow. You need to admit when you are wrong. You need to apologize. You need to grow and be mature. Our next really, really hard truth that I have certainly been feeling lately, and I might read this entire one off because I have related to just about every single point in this hard truth. And that is that in order to really get what you want in life, in order to really, really, really reach your goal, you, 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 you are going to have to work. You're going to have to work really hard. And you're going to have to sacrifice things. You might have to sacrifice friendships. You might have to sacrifice your social life. You might have to sacrifice money. You might have to sacrifice a little bit of your own sanity. But if you really want to succeed, if you really want to achieve your dreams in life, you have no other option but to work. You are going to have to work get what you want. You are going to have to work to get what you want. You have to work hard. You have to work hard. You have to work hard to get what you want. There is no free ride. There is no free ticket. Even the people you see online that you think, oh, Maybe that rich kid didn't have to work so hard, but you know what? His parents did. Somebody along the way to all that success had to work really, 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 really hard. So if you really want to succeed in life, you are going to have to work hard. You are going to have to put in a lot of effort. You are going to have to make sacrifices, you have to understand that if you really want it, you have to be willing to make sacrifices. You might lose friends. You might lose sleep. But if you really want to succeed, then you have to work hard. There is no other way around it. If you really want it, have to work for it. No ifs, ands, or buts. You have to, have to, have to work hard. And then the shitty thing about that is, (laughs) it's important, but hard work does not always guarantee success. The challenge of success is often quite mysterious. There is a bit of luck involved in success with a lot of people, but they didn't just get there by luck. They worked hard and then got lucky. So if you want to get lucky one of these days, you are going to have to work hard first. You're going to have to work hard. It's really, really hard. 
and then hope that you get lucky one day. There's no other way around it. You cannot wait for any miracles to happen. They're just not going to happen. Maybe you'll get maybe that one person who gets lucky. But there's 7.8 billion people in the world. And not many of them get that lucky. You have to remember that you have to be different. You are not born different. You are not born different. You are not born special. You are not born special. You have to become different. You have to be different. You have to make yourself special. You have to make yourself special. You have to work hard. You have to work hard. And accept that you might fail. Life is full of failures. But you'll never know if you don't try. After all, you don't know unless you go for it. And life's all about taking risks, isn't it? Now, this is a kind of a silly hard truth, but I liked it. So I left it in. And that is that no, unfortunately for us all, you are not Clint Eastwood in the Western movies. For those of you who are a bit younger watching this, Clint Eastwood was a cowboy. And he would end almost every movie by riding off into the sunset. You're not going to ride off into a sunset. You're not Clint Eastwood. You're not a cowboy. You're not in a movie. This is your life. If you really, 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 really want to feel like the main character of your own life, then you have to work for it. Then we go right back to our last point, that you have to work hard, that you are not born different. You have to become different. It's not going to happen overnight. You're going to have to work for it. You're going to have to work really, really, really hard for it. Our next truth. Not there may have ruined the whole video and made it really loud. I don't know. I might have to edit that part out. Our next truth is that going through tough times does not necessarily always mean you'll have it easy anytime soon. And I hate this one. I really, really hate this tough truth because the majority of my life has felt like it's been tough times, but I have come to accept that it might never get easier. This could be my life, your, your, your entire life could be difficult. That could just be your life, but the sooner you accept it, the easier it is to not care. It's almost a nihilistic approach, but it really does help out. Being nihilistic doesn't mean that you're sad or, I don't know, like, oh, the world is doomed. It really does just mean that you don't care. It's kind of peaceful. It's kind of freeing. But you have to accept that there might not be good times ahead. The world could be nothing but difficult times. Hard, 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 hard times. Remember, you didn't just have to try. You'll never know unless you try. And our next half truth before we end on the um, the really tough truth. <laughs> this one's a little silly, but I liked it anyways. And that is that at some point in your life, you're going to be embarrassed. And I mean like horribly embarrassed. At some point in your life, you're going to go up to someone in a bar and try to hit on them and not realize that your skirt is still tucked into your underwear and that everybody can see your legs. 
going to happen. Maybe not exactly in that way, but something to that matter, something to that fact. Something like that is going to happen to you. If it hasn't happened already, you're going to embarrass yourself horribly. You're going to call someone by the wrong name in front of a bunch of people. You're going to puke on stage in front of a bunch of people. You're going to do something really, really, really embarrassing. And it's going to make you want to hide in a hole. Maybe your mom will show your significant other all your baby photos. Maybe you'll say something really dumb while you're intoxicated. The important thing to remember is not to make a big deal out of it. Because the fun thing about embarrassing moments is that if you forget about it, typically other people will forget about it too. If you can learn to laugh at yourself, then other people aren't laughing at you. Then other people are laughing with you. And it's oh, oh, oh. Oh, so nice to get to laugh with other people. So, just remember that you cannot save yourself from embarrassing moments. They're going to happen. And now, before we do the final tough truth, the hardest and the biggest pill that there is to swallow, I would like very much if we would go over some of the other tough truths, a recap of what we've learned so far. So far we've learned that you, you cannot control other people. You are the only person in control of your life. You cannot control other people. You are the only person in control of your life. You cannot control other people. You are the only person in control of your life. Sometimes the problem is you. Sometimes the problem is you. Sometimes you're the issue. Sometimes you're the problem. Sometimes you're the one who needs to say sorry. Sometimes you're the one who needs to apologize. Sometimes it really is you. In order to get what you want in life, you are going to have to work hard. In order to get what you want in life, you are going to have to work hard. You are going to have to put in work to get what you want in life. You are going to have to work hard. You are going to have to work hard. You have to work hard in life in order to get what you want. Nothing happens overnight. Everything takes time. Nothing happens overnight. Everything takes time. 
Everything in life takes time. Nothing, 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 nothing is going to happen overnight. Everything takes time. You're going to have to work hard in order to achieve what you want. Nobody thinks about you as much as you do. Nobody thinks about you as much as you do. Nobody thinks about you as much as you do. Nobody thinks about you as much as you do. You are the captain of your ship. You are the master of your own reality. You are the captain of your ship. You are the master of your reality. You are the master of your own reality. You are the captain of your own ship. You are in charge of your reality. You are in control of your own ship. Nobody else. Just you. Some people will love you. Some people will not love you. You have to accept that not everyone is going to love you. You have to accept that not everyone is going to love you. Some people will love you. Some people will not love you. You have to accept that not everyone is going to love you. You have to accept that not everyone is going to love you. You have to accept that not everyone is going to love you. You have to accept that not everyone has to love you. You have to accept that not everyone has to love you. You are going to fail. You are going to fail many times in life. You are going to fail. You are going to fail many times in life. You you are going to fail. Failure is a part of life. 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 You have to accept that you, you are going to fail. Someone will always have more than you. Someone will always have more than you. The grass might always be greener on the other side. The grass might always be greener. Someone is always going to be better than you. Someone is always going to be better than you. You have to accept that you are going to fail. You have to accept that you are going to fail. Someone is always going to have more than you. Someone is always going to have more than you. Someone is always going to have more than you. And let's not forget that you 
you, 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 you cannot control other people. You cannot control other people. You cannot control other people. You cannot. You cannot. You cannot control other people. You cannot control other people. You are only in control of yourself. You cannot control other people. And now, I'm going to end with the final heart. The hard, hard, hard truth. The hard truth. The hard truth. The toughest of toughest of toughest of pills to swallow. And that is that. And I'll put it lightly. I'll word it nicely. Entropy is real. There's no way around it. Entropy is real. Entropy is real. There's no way around it. Entropy is real. You have to accept that one day everything is going to end. Entropy means that everything, everything, everything comes to an end. Everything comes to an end. Everything has an end. Everything comes to an end. Everything has an end. Entropy is real. Now, I know that's hard for a lot of people to hear, but just remember that none of these tough truths are meant to discourage you. Just use these things to motivate you. Remember that you, you there, right there, you're in charge of your life right now. You are the master of your own reality. You are the master of your own reality. Nobody else is responsible for you. You are responsible for yourself. You are responsible for yourself. The one, the one isn't out there. You need to learn how to complete yourself. You need to learn how to make yourself happy. The one isn't out there. You need to learn how to complete yourself. You have to learn how to make yourself happy. Don't let these things discourage you. Don't let these truths bring you down. Understand that this is just the way life is. You have to work hard. You have to be different. And that you are capable of doing it. But you have to work for it. Well, I hope you enjoy the rest of your night. I hope that this finds you well. And if it doesn't find you when you're in a good spot, I hope that maybe at least one how these hard truths has helped you to get a little kick in the bum, to get
get you going and get you moving. Have a good night. Have a good day. Have a good night. Have a good day. And never, ever forget that you and only you and nobody else, just you, just you, just you are the master of your own reality. <laughs>